Mechanical Pump System There are four main components to a mechanical pump system. The tank, inlet check valve, mechanical pump, and outlet check valve. Coming off the cap of the pump, we have two connections. One for a vent line, which gets vented out back to our tank, and a motive connection that is connected to a pressure regulator off of pressurized steam or compressed air. When in service, a condensate stream enters the inlet to our tank. This tank separates the condensate from any flash steam. As the tank fills, it drains through the pump inlet check valve and then into the pump body. The outlet check valve, which is piped back to a pressurized system or the boiler room, is held closed by back pressure. At this point, the tank and pump are operating at the same pressure. The vent valve is open and the motive valve is closed and the pump fills. Once the condensate level in the pump gets near the top, an internal mechanism closes the vent valve and opens the motive valve. This fills the pump with pressure, which pushes down on the liquid level. The condensate can't go back towards the tank because of the inlet check valve, so the only way out is through the outlet check valve. While the condensate is being pumped, the liquid level in the tank starts rising from incoming condensate. Once the level in the pump is down towards the bottom, the internal mechanism closes the motive valve and opens up the vent valve. The pressure inside the pump vents back to the tank and the process starts over filling the pump. For more products, tips, and insight, check out the Campbell CV website.